We're, we're here to talk about the uh, first day of uh, the I-64 closure after the holidays. And uh, this morning and, and this evening both went fairly well. Um, we, we did see tonight that we're probably back to pretty much normal volumes on the freeways, and they all functioned as normal or better than normal tonight. Um, most of our issues on most of the arterial routes ran really well tonight with the exception of a couple, and I'm going to let uh, the county and the city talk about those. We would like to recommend uh, people in Clayton that can get to uh, 170 southbound to Eager Road eastbound to Hanley. That's a very good alternate route. It's very underutilized at this time. One other uh, underutilized route is if you're going to northwest part of the county to take uh, Hanley Road to Midland, Midland to Lindbergh is very underutilized also. But other than that, we had some heavy traffic at the Big Bend and Forest Park Parkway, but nothing that hasn't been from the previous two weeks. So that's all I have. Forest Park and Skinker is our big major intersection. Uh, this evening rush, we had over 2,000 cars go through westbound during a one hour period. That almost sets a new record. So like Ed said, I think we're there. We're where the volumes are going to be for a while. People need to, you know, if you don't want to wait three signals to go west on Forest Park at Skinker, you need to find a different route. That's the way it's going to be until people go somewhere else. Plenty of room on Page Avenue, a couple blocks north. Uh, we're very comfortable where we're at. We're going to keep with it. We're not walking away from this. We're going to have the people on the ground again tomorrow morning. And we're going to continue this effort to try to make everybody have the best ride we can give them. So... If you like Forest Park and you're comfortable with a little delay, stay there. If you're not, try a different route. We're going to continue to, to watch traffic patterns and, and make sure that we're on top of things. Um, I think for tomorrow morning's rush, you know, this morning we had heavy traffic on Brentwood. And like Gus told you, the, uh, the Hanley Eager to 170 is a good option tomorrow morning. So that seems to be really uh, probably your best bet. Um, and, and we'll keep working on the signals on Brentwood to, to make sure that keeps functioning too. Uh, any questions? Well, in the press release you said that uh, Brentwood wasn't a problem this evening. Why do you think it wasn't a problem as opposed to this morning when it was a problem? Well, I think what we saw is that a lot of people went to Big Bend. Um, so, you know, we're saying it's Han and tonight Hanley was, if you went the eager to Hanley route, that was still a good option tonight, wide open. So that's kind of where we're saying is your best option really in the morning and the evening, what we've seen after the first day. Okay. Do you guys think that uh, Brentwood may be a problem again tomorrow morning, though, even though we're getting the word out? I, I think if people don't change, um, yeah, if they do what they did this morning, Brentwood's going to be a problem tomorrow. So use Hanley. Hanley to one, you know, Hanley eager to 170.